Hello friends, in this video I shall take up uh, five problems for practice using the important concept of board mass. Now let me just uh, uh, tell you once what does board mass mean and apart from uh, these operations what is this bar. Now see uh, this bar is called a vinculum and uh, this vinculum is basically an operation uh, it stands for like this minus is outside the vinculum so we have to remove the vinculum sign first by simplifying the terms which are under the bar so that means this is vinculum so v stands for vinculum and followed by b brackets we have to solve the brackets then o o for off like in this question we have off off means multiply and then d for divide m for multiply a for addition and S for subtraction. So these are the operations and the sequence in which we have to apply the operations to get to our answer accurately and quickly. So let's see the first question using this concept. Now see here there is no vinculum, so we will get on with the brackets. Now in the brackets we have this parenthesis first, so we will simplify the parenthesis bracket first. So in competitions, when you get this question, you have to first see this bracket, that is the sequence of uh, using the brackets is this, the first bracket to be solved is this, then followed by the curly brackets and followed by the square brackets. So we have only the parenthesis, that is the and this bracket and the curly brackets here. There is no square bracket, so this is a less complicated problem, but in this case, we have vinculum also and then all the three types of brackets also. So this will take a little bit more time as compared to this. But you need to be well acquainted with the procedure to solve the first question and the second question first. So let's see the terms in the first bracket. So in this we have two operations. This is multiply and this is subtract. So among multiply and subtract, multiply comes first. So we will multiply this first. So this part will give you 6. And now 6 minus 4, this entire part will give you 2. Again, multiply and subtract. So do not subtract first because S comes last. M comes first. So multiply first, 2 into 3, 6. And now 6 minus 4 is 2. So this bracket simplifies to 2. Now I'll write the remaining question now. 17 minus curly bracket, 8 and divide by and now this bracket has solved to 2 so this bracket is removed and now curly bracket closed now see in one step we have reduced the problem to half and now let us solve the second bracket that is the curly bracket here if you simplify this 8 divided by 2 is 4 and now since we have only single term in curly bracket we can remove the curly bracket also thereby giving us 17 minus 4 which is 13 so the answer for the first question is 13. Students who have mastery over this concept, they can solve this problem just by looking at the problem, they will get to the answer. So first of all, you uh, write all the steps and then try to solve it by leaving the steps subsequently. So let's see the second question. Now in the second question, we have see only this bracket. So there are two, two brackets. So we need to simplify the bracket which contains more than two terms. Here there is only one term minus 4 but here we have two terms. So let us simplify this first. So this will come out to be 23 plus 18 divided by now 8 minus 2 is 6 so I will remove this bracket now and write 6 here then plus 3 multiplied by minus 4. Now in the second step we will have the operations in sequence of board mass that is we have to uh, take care of the divide first, then multiply, then add and then subtract. This is the sequence of steps to be, operations to be followed. Let's see the first operation in this question. See here we have uh, this 8 minus 2 which we have solved to 6 and now we have this divide. So this part will be solved first. So 18 divided by 6, we all know that it is 3. Now the question reduces to 23 plus 3 plus now see this operation. Now if I write this operation here, 
I have to take care of the multiply sign next because we have after divide we have the multiply operation. So if you solve this here also, then you can reduce one step. Now 3 into minus 4 is minus 12. So I'll write it in the bracket like this. So now the question reduces to a very very simple form. So this is 23 plus 3 now plus and minus you can do simultaneously also you all know integers. So this is 26 and plus minus minus 12 and uh, the answer for the question now comes out to be 26 minus 12 that is 14. So this is the second question in this uh, series of 5 questions. Now let's see the third one. Here we have the vinculum sign. So we need to take care of the vinculum sign first. So I'll write the entire question as it is 2 into 5 minus 8 minus curly bracket 11 plus 30 divided by. Now you see 7 minus 5. This is to uh, be done first to remove this vinculum sign. And we all know that 7 minus 5 is uh, 2 and uh, 4 minus 2 is 2. So I have a 2 here after removing this bracket and the vinculum sign thereby uh, reducing this problem to a little bit simpler one because now I don't have the vinculum sign and I don't have the curly, uh, this uh, parenthesis also. So let's uh, now solve the curly brackets. The second bracket here is the curly bracket. So how do I, how I solve this curly bracket? Now see in curly bracket I have two operations. One is the addition and one is division. Among addition and division, division come first. So let me divide it first. So if you divide this you will get 15 and 11 plus 15 will reduce to 26 thereby removing the curly brackets as well. So another bracket gone in this step and now finally we have 2 into 5 minus. Now let's remove this bracket also. This is a negative uh, difference. So 8 minus 26 is minus 18 and now this is multiply. So we have to multiply first then subtract. So this is 10 and minus minus becomes plus 18 which gives you 28 as the answer of this important problem. You can see it once and now let's get on with the fourth one. So in this question we have two parenthesis brackets and we have a off here. So O stands for off. So let's see this uh, operation off first. What is 3 of 2? 3 of 2 is 6, 3 into 2 and I am writing the remaining part as it is. Now let's solve this one, 5 minus 3, very simple, 2 and let's simplify now further. This bracket is to be removed, so 6 plus 4, 10, 10 minus 3, we have a 7 here and minus 9 times 2 is 18 and now we, we have only two operations, division and subtraction. So what comes first, division or subtraction? It is division. So let's divide first. So 14 divided by 7 is 2 and minus 18. So we have to subtract a larger number from a smaller number. So our answer will be negative, thereby giving us minus 16 as the answer for this important question. Now let's apply this method for the final question here. Now in the final question, we have all the operations. See, we have a vinculum, then we have the parenthesis, the curly brackets and the square brackets. So what is the operation? V comes first. It is the vinculum which has to be taken care of first. So let us remove this vinculum from here. Uh, I'll solve it here only so that I can save some time and space. Now see this 3 minus 6 is minus 3. So 3 minus 6, if 3 minus 6 is minus 3 then now vinculum is gone. But I have two negative signs here. So in this bracket, I have 9 minus minus 3. And what is 9 minus minus 3? I'll just write it for you here. 9 minus minus 3 is 9 plus 3, which is 12. So actually, this part, I'm encircling the part, this part comes out to be 12. And now I will write the remaining part. See? 11 minus 7 minus curly brackets 5 minus 3 times this is bracket so 3 times the simplified form of this is 12 and I have the curly brackets and the square brackets closed. So complexity is reduced to a great extent here and next step 
we have 11 minus 7 minus now let's solve this curly brackets now see 3 times 12 this is 36 and 5 minus 36 is minus 31 so we have a, a small bracket here because two negative signs are coming together so let's simplify this 11 minus 7 now this is 7 plus 31 minus minus is plus 31 which gives us 11 minus 38 so final answer for our question is minus 27 so this is the way we have to solve the simplification problems based on board mass you can see it once take the screenshot and save it for future reference these type of questions are very very common in all competitions and especially class 7 students they are solving all these variety of questions at school level so friends if you like this video if, if you have understood the use of v that is vinculum and then the subsequent operations of bracket of divide multiply add and subtract then do share it with your friends who will be greatly benefited by this video and do not forget to subscribe the channel